This week at Interior, Secretary Jewell was on hand this week to help honor groups and individuals that work hand in hand with Interior to help conserve and protect our lands and resources. The 2013 Partners in Conservation Award ceremony specifically recognized 20 public-private partnerships celebrating conservation achievements and highlighting cooperation among diverse federal, state, local, and tribal governments, public and private groups, nonprofit organizations, and individuals. When we engage citizens from a wide spectrum of interests, when we listen to each other, and we find that common ground, and you are all here because you found common ground with each other and with us to help move our conservation legacy in this country forward in a way that's sustainable for the people that come after us. One of the initiatives celebrated was the recent historic agreement on Colorado River cooperation between the United States and Mexico. During a period of historic drought in the Colorado River Basin, the two countries have agreed to improve water management and protect important resources in the Colorado River Delta. Mexican Ambassador Eduardo Medina Mora was on hand to accept the award and to meet with Secretary Jewell on future opportunities for cooperation. For a full list of all the groups recognized this year, check out DOI.gov. Secretary Jewell is applauding President Obama's intent to nominate Dr. Suzette Kimball for director of the U.S. Geological Survey. Kimball has been leading USGS in an acting capacity for nearly a year after three years as deputy director. If confirmed by the U.S. Senate, Kimball will lead an agency with more than 8,000 scientists, technicians, and support staff in more than 400 locations across the country, performing the USGS mission of providing reliable scientific information about the Earth, minimizing loss of life and property from natural disasters, managing water, biological, energy, and mineral resources while enhancing and protecting our way of life. A meeting this week between Secretary Jewell and NASA Administrator Charles Bolden at NASA headquarters. NASA and Interior are working together across a range of scientific programs, most notably sharing and studying data generated by Landsat 8, an Earth observation satellite launched by NASA last February, now managed by USGS. The Landsat images provide the content for apps like Google Earth. When it comes to wildlife in the great outdoors, birds are hard to beat. The U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service reports that some 18 million people turn out every year for wild bird outings, more than any other animal. And there are few better places to check out our fine feathered friends than National Wildlife Refuges. Now the Fish and Wildlife Service has put together a handy month-by-month -month TikTok of bird festivals coast to coast and the refuges where you can find them. Find that list at fws.gov. And the number of viewers for Interior's Instagram feed continues to skyrocket. In July, our Instagram feed had 70,000 followers. This week, that number is approaching 200,000, all of them checking out the incredible images of national parks, wildlife refuges, and other public lands under Interior's oversight. Check it out for yourself at Instagram.com slash USInterior. That's this week at Interior. <laughs>